Hey guys, welcome back to The Gamer Play. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Chrono Trigger for the Sony PlayStation. And this game is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, we just kicked Yakra's asshole. And it's time to get out of here. Let's do that. Let's return to the castle. It's like a happy ending. All's well. Game over. You had me worried, Lean. That no-good Yakra impersonating me and kidnapping the queen. We must create a criminal justice system in this kingdom to do away with such fiends. I failed to protect Queen Lean. I hath disgraced thee. Frog! Frog left. Your timing was perfect. Who knows what would have happened had you not saved me. By the way, where is the girl who was mistaken for me? Oh yeah, I forgot all about Princess Nadia. Chrono, where did Princess Nadia disappear? She may still be there. Thank you, Chrono. But who was that girl we found in the canyon? I always like when you try and run but get stuck on something, Chrono shakes his head like, that doesn't work, that doesn't work. The king and queen make such a great couple. <laughs> that doesn't work. So, she wasn't lean after all. Well, we gotta get Marley, man. She's gotta be up there, right? I'm coming, Marley! I'm coming for you, kid! Huh? What happened? Princess Nadia! Chrono! It was awful. I can't recall at all. I was somewhere cold, dark, and lonely. Is that what it's like to die? Welcome back, Princess Nadia. You risked your life for me to help me too? Princess Nadia? Uh-oh. I guess you guys figured it out, huh? Sorry, Chrono. I didn't mean to deceive you. I'm Princess Nadia. My father's King Guardia, the 35th. Or is that 8th? Ah. I really enjoyed being with you at the fair. But if you had known my identity... Chrono, you wouldn't have shown me around the fair, right? Okay, there's a little multiple choice. Doesn't really affect anything. Uh, let's go with... Wrong. Oh, Chrono, that's why I like you. Real queen safe, right? So let's go home, Chrono. <laughs> you might want to make sure on that, Marley. You know, she is your ancestor, after all. What do these guys say? You guys leaving? Wherever you're heading, be careful. Which means the real lean was somewhere else. It's exactly as I thought. <laughs> what about you, buddy? No, no, not you. You! Hmm. The more I look at you, the stronger the resemblance. Uncanny. <laughs> that guy. That guy's my favorite. I love that guy. Hanging around the chicks. What are they, like maids? I don't know. <laughs> well, nothing much to do but blow this joint. was a fault of mine which endangered the queen. I shall depart for good. Eee! Indeed, your resemblance to the queen is uncanny. Chrono, you have potential to be a good swordsman. Froggy, you weren't such a bad guy either. This ought to relieve the king. Lean's presence always brightens things up. Sure we're lucky defeating Yakra and all. Nah, luck had nothing to do with it, buddy. You can come and go as you please from now on. 
Let's head downstairs real fast. I just, I just love going down here. It's so much fun. What are you guys doing? Now the Night Captain can concentrate on battling Magus' troops. See, even the, all the non-playable characters have something new to say. Hard to believe she really wasn't lean. This is great! Yeah, yeah, okay. Maybe not everybody. Well, Lean would never snack before meals like that other girl did. I thought she ate too much to be our queen. The real Lean? Wonderful! Let's prepare a feast! What? That wasn't Queen Lean? And I wasted my time whipping up a bunch of that ice cream dish she wanted so badly. Yuck! Out of the way. That doesn't work, Chrono. That doesn't work. You gotta love the uh, the castle theme, by the way. So where the hell did Frog go, anyway? Oh, great! We have to go through the forest. Ah, uh, you see? A little more cleared out this time, isn't it? A little easier to navigate through, eh? How about that? You see, they make it easier and less annoying for you. Thank you. Let's go to the bridge. That frog made it across by swimming to the other side. Nope. Nope. Chrono can't make it. Nope. Nope. No go. I think even the uh, the residents uh, say uh, different things. Let's go to uh, let's go check out Luca's ancestors because they're obviously her ancestors. They don't live on that island yet, do they? I guess they weren't banished yet. No banishment. Is this it? Uh, unfortunate bell for the king to present to the lovely queen. I lost it when the. Uh, oh no, it's the same thing. What do you think about Luke? What do you think about that, Luca? Help a hundred years, your ancestor. But hey, man, we've spent a long time here in the Middle Ages, in the year uh, 600. Time to go back to Truce Canyon. Get the hell out of here. It's time. But there's something, the guy. There's something about these guys' faces. I don't know, I just, I have to do something about their faces. I think I have to kill them. There's something about their faces. I gotta change it for them. It's just the way I was brought up. If I have a problem with some guy's face, I have to do something about it. Okay, okay, all's fine. Now we can leave. Oh, son of a bitch. It can't escape this battle. Well, unless you want to escape the battle. Polly. Polly, Polly. <laughs> I kind of like those things. They roll up into that little ball. They look like some kind of animal you could actually, like, you know, have in the house and, and train to do tricks. You know? I don't know. I mean, they have cats in this game. They have cats as pets. I don't think there's any dogs, though, are there? No dogs. I mean, the imps in this game talk, but do those, uh, do those poly things talk? I don't know. I don't think there's a scene where they talk. How do we get home? Your Highness, or Princess, we... Uh, please, call me Marley. Well then, Marley, observe. hoo Wow! Luca, you're amazing! <laughs> Ain't it the truth? Oh, um, I mean... Enough with the false modesty. You have a real gift. I would trade my royal ancestry for your genius in a heartbeat. Well, if you say so. Anyway, I call this thing a gate. 
it's a kind of portal that takes you to a, the same location in a different era. Gates are very unstable, so I use the principle behind my telepod device. Create a gate key. Now we can use them as we please. But why did this gate suddenly appear? Either the telepod had something to do with it, or something else made it. This is getting pretty weird. Let's at least head back to our own time. Alright! Coming, Chrono? No, I'm not coming. See you later, ladies. Goodbye, I'm staying here forever. Ah! Whew! Alright, guys, uh, it's been a great gamer play. It looks like the game's over. I want to thank you all for watching. Oh, wait, there's more. Awesome stuff. Anyway, guys, this part is over. Stay tuned for the next part of Chrono Trigger. I'll see you guys next time. I am out.